Did you know that people are ready to invest in crypto? Well, let's take a look because we have a big question to answer today. One of our members has asked, if I had $1,000, where can I invest it today? And we're going to take a look at a few coins that are out there in the world that are very important and are going to be making immense moves in the next several months, if not years. So here we go. Number one is Polygon Matic. Polygon Matic. Let's look at the chart here first. Let's see what it looks like. Uh, let's see if we can get some more information there. So you can see it started out, geez, many years ago back here. This doesn't go too far back, but I'd say at least to 2019. You can see it peaked up here back on May 17th of this past year, the 2021. And now, where is it at right now? Well, back then it was at 267. Now it's at 219. What do you think? Is it worthwhile investment? Is it a worthwhile investment? Polygon Matic has a lot going for it. It has a lot of news. It has a lot of things that it's working for. And some of the, that news you need to research. I'm going to try and take a look and see if there's anything quickly here that, that can tell you more information in reference to this one. Let me just take a look at a different chart here and see how it looks in reference to that. So you can see here that people have dumped a little bit in, in reference to Polygon Matic. It's a good time to dip by. It's almost reached its consolidation, uh, its uh, support level down here. And I'd say it's a good buy. If you had $1,000 in here, you could put 30% in here. If it drops a little bit more, hey, that can happen. But it's a good dip buy right now, considering that the overall coin market is doing very well. And this one, Polygon Matic, is a good hold for the long term. I would do that. Now, let's take it, see if there's any news in reference to Polygon Matic. Uh, let's see here. Polygon Matic, this was released a day ago. Polygon Matic climbed 70% in October as bullish momentum continues into November. That sounds wonderful. Although there isn't much more news in reference to this one, that is pretty good news. Noticing that it did go spike up on November 3rd from when it was at 194 and it went up to 215. That's a good, what, 15% or so, if not a little bit more or something like that. And now it's back down. Now it's back down even below what it was then. It's at 189. This is one of the reasons I tell people you've got to be able to take some of your investments, cash in on them so that you can benefit from your returns. Well, that's what other people are doing. That's why people are selling off in here. I mean, if there's any negative news, I'm not researching this right now, but if there was any negative news, that will also determine whether people are dumping it for some other reason. But Polygon Matic is a great hole for the long term. And it's, it's below $2 range. It's a good dip buy. And I would purchase this when I do have Polygon Matic in my portfolio. And I recommend for you to hold on to it as well. It is, it is uh, almost forming this cup shape right in here. I know it looks a little weird, but it is a cup. And when it gets to here, we're hoping that it keep, continues to break out because in or the stock market, usually it won't break out. It will go right back down once it hits that area. And that's where we're being shown right now. You can see here, there's another cup right here. And now it's broken down into here. What's going to happen now with this one? I would say it's a good dip buy. I, I, I would purchase at least 20 to 30% if I had $1,000 in reference to this one. Now, let's take a look at another one. Cardano, 88 Cardano is also under $2. And let's just see what the charts have to say. It reached its high back in September 7th or so, $3. And now it's down to somewhere around 198. So it's dropped 30% from that point back in September. Amazing. Is this a good dip buy? I say yes, this is a good dip buy. Is there anything in reference to news that's standing out? Let's take a look here and see if there's any news that, okay, so here we go. Institutional investments into cryptos like Solana, Cardano, and Bitcoin. We're speaking about Cardano. We spoke about Polygon Matic, and we're going to speak about Solana in a moment. This is great. This is 12 hours ago. I'm big on these. I believe these are great holds for the long term. In reference to Solana, 
to Solana is worth 239.92 right now, USD. And this one, is it a hold for the long term? Let's just take a look at the chart here. You can see it's at its highs, at its highs. Would I purchase into this one? Let's just take a look at a different chart and see what it looks like. See if there's any other news. So it's, it's starting to consolidate right there. What's going to happen? This one, if it doesn't break, it's going to go down. When it dips, then I would consider a dip buy for Solana. Why not? If it co continues to go upward, I would still hold out until I see a dip buy. Why? Because look, it reached a peak here, its resistance, and went back down. Another peak, down. Peak, down. Peak, down. So it's going to happen again. Probably right in here, it'll go down at least what 10 percent if you have a 10 percent meaning two 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 hundred and twenty ish level i would buy i would buy from out of the thousand dollars i would buy at least 40 percent on solana for solana is very good for the long term let's see if there's any other news as we go into solana and check a sol price prediction astronomical gains expected for solana in second half of Quarter four. That's right now. This was just published about three hours ago. What is the Solana ecosystem and how is it fueling Sol's strat stratospheric rise? That's awesome. Awesome news. I'm not going to read into this because that can take time and you can do that on your own. This is part of the research that you need to do to find out what is the best place to invest. Now, here's another coin that I want to show you. Suku. Suku I've been watching for several weeks now. I've been alerting it since it was a 52 cents Right now, it's currently at, well, if we look at this chart, this chart is deceiving. Now, you see here, this was its high point, 260. That's not the deceiving point. You see right here, right now, it's at, where does it say? Is that right? It's saying it's at 155 or so is, is the top right here. But if we look at this in a different chart, let's like take a look at the four-hour chart. You can see it's already dropped from there. It's at $1.18 right now. That's a great dip buy for Suku, but I believe it's going to come even down further to closer to the dollar range. It's going to come down. Is this a coin worth having? Now, this is what I've told people in my other videos. Number one is I like it for investment for the long term. However, we have to be clear. Look at how many times you could have cashed in and made some money. Recently, this was in October 27th. It went up to 148. This is the day before the news was released that it was going to go into Coinbase. And then it dropped all the way to 72 cents or so. I recommended people to buy at 79 cents. I didn't know what the bottom was, but that's where I recommended people to buy it. And in, I also told people that they, if they had $1,000, they should invest 10 to 20% at a dollar, 10 to 20% at 80-ish cents. I think it was 87 cents. And then everything else below that. If you would have invested it that way, you would have made some great returns if you would have cashed out, if you would have cashed out. And then now that it's that you've cashed out, let's say you would have cashed out at 150 right up here. Now it's at 117. This would be a great dip buy. Even if it's not the bottom, it's better than where you sold off at 150 or 155 and so on. That's why I highly recommend for people that are wanting to make money in reference to their investments, they have to go in and out. If you're just parking your money, somebody else is going to utilize it. Somebody else is going to make money off of your money. So why not let that be you, the person who's making the money? So what are you waiting for? What's the magic, I don't know, touch of the hand that you're waiting for or something like that? What are you doing now to increase your income? That is my big question for you. What are you doing now to increase your income? You see, in order to earn more money, you've got to learn. And the more you learn, your money market account will grow multiplied. Stay safe. This is CEO Trades, where money works for you. Please like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to sign up for our alerts in this channel. Have a safe one. And until tomorrow.